Now the On Your Side forecast with Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval. Well, pretty nice day out there today. The breeze blowing. That boy, that really made a difference, didn't it? It was so stagnant a couple of days ago, but today, that nice northwesterly breeze making you feel refreshing. It is getting hot this afternoon, and it is definitely dry. The air mass, not much moisture in it at all. That's why it's such a good view from the village at Birdie and seeing the Boise front here. And there you see that flag blowing. Uh, we've got a good breeze out of the northwest. Let's take a look at the latest temperature. And in Boise, we have touched 90, in fact, 91 degrees. Notice the humidity down to 13%. So it is very dry. And it is is breezy, so any human caused fires that are started uh, could spread rapidly in a situation like this. And so keep that in mind. We are in the process now as we're moving through June here with the temperatures coming up of really drying out the grasses. They're going to start to die off, and the fuels are going to be out there for those rangeland fires. So just keep that in mind. North Northwest breeze at 12. We've had gusts over 20 miles an hour at times. Not bad. That keeps it refreshing. And McCall, how about this for a nice day? 80 degrees, blue skies, and a little bit of a breeze out on the lake after a low of 50 this morning. That is very inviting up there at Payette Lake and up at Sun Valley. Looks quite nice as well. Don't forget the sawtooth relay going into the, in the uh, mountains here between Stanley and Sun Valley over the weekend, Friday to Saturday. And we're talking about some amazing weather. Instead of being 81 like it was today around Sun Valley, it'll be in the lower 70s. So some real nice weather, low 70s uh, in Stanley. Overnight lows and some of those racers are getting up early in the morning will be in the upper 30s and standing, but that's real nice for a little running out there. And so again, I think sunshine we're going to get rid of. Even these low clouds you see right here, that lingering moisture is going to disappear. We're going to be drying out. And here is Stanley right now. If we're going over Redfish Lake, 77 for the high temperature. Again, getting cooler by about uh, ooh, 6 to 8 degrees as we head up for the uh, weekend. Beautiful in the Magic Valley with sunshine. Temperatures in the 80s as well, 87. I expect it to be dry everywhere across the state. As I mentioned, no cloud cover. 95 still in Ontario. Still hotter in those lower western elevations, but Everybody will start to cool down the next couple days, and we'll keep that northwesterly breeze coming on in. That dry air has been working its way in. The showers and storms are being suppressed down to the south, and that's the way it should stay with those thunderstorms to the south. We've got a wedge of that heat coming across southwest Idaho, so our temperatures have popped up a bit after the cloud cover we had yesterday. But notice the jet stream here. South of the jet stream is warm. North of the jet stream is cooler. And disturbances right along that jet stream. And you can see this little dip right here. That's the cooler weather. And that's going to slide on by. And as it does, it'll drop our temperature a little bit. But it'll still stay in the 80s. So some very pleasant weather coming in over the weekend. Here it is here on Wednesday, Thursday now. There's the dip in the jet stream as it pushes to the east. Energy will stay to the north, but these lines here indicating the jet stream sagging to the south, bringing in the northwesterly flow. And notice the real searing heat gets suppressed to the south. So I think we've got a very pleasant weekend ahead with temperatures dropping back down. You'll see here that cool push coming in Friday. The showers and storms may be confined into Canada and the heat down to the south. And so tomorrow, some nice weather as well. We just start ratcheting the temperature down a few more degrees. And by the weekend, we're talking lower. 80. Sunshine tomorrow. Northwest winds 10 to 20. Could get gusty in the afternoon. Pretty much just like today, but take about another 5 degrees off the temperature. 86 in Meridian for the high tomorrow. That's pretty nice. Into the mountains, absolutely delightful. Long Valley, 76 degrees. Deep blue sky tomorrow. That cobalt blue in the mountains with sunshine and light winds. Beautiful everywhere tomorrow. Stanley and Sun Valley. Temperatures into the 70s. Gorgeous weather. In the Magic Valley tomorrow, mostly sunny. Bring those temperatures down a few degrees to 84 in Twin and Shoshone. 82 in Burley. A westerly breeze at 10 to 15. And my extended forecast, no probability of precipitation. You see, there's no numbers here, so we stay dry and we cool down to 83 over the weekend. Look how pleasant this is. And then up to 90 by Monday. So it does heat up a bit next week, but it doesn't get real searing hot. Not looking at 100 degrees and low 80s over the weekend. Now, that is some very pleasant weather to get outside and enjoy. So enjoy Boy, it's a it. Perfect indeed. weekend. Love it. it. Looks wonderful. Love it. Yeah. Well, now to that.